Trackle is a sensor that uh, measures the body core temperature in a row and transfers it wirelessly to a mobile app. And uh, we detect the moment of ovulation with a reliability of 98%. Trackle is a brand new startup that's located in Bonn and has been founded in December 2015. We have developed a variable that helps women to detect their individual fertility window. Why that? Basically, there are two groups of women who are really interested in getting to know when they are fertile. There's on the one hand, those who want to get pregnant. They need to understand when to have sex to make it happen. And on the other hand, those who don't want to get pregnant, but do not want to use hormone contraception all the time. These both groups could, in theory, use an indication of fertility that the female body provides. It's a significant rise of the body core temperature in the moment of ovulation. But uh, I can tell you from my own experience that detecting that rise is a nightmare. It means that you have to get up every morning at the same time, have to take your temperature manually, transfer it to an app or a piece of paper or whatever, and you have to avoid noises that could influence the body core temperature. Means no drinks, no crying kids at night, no life, basically. It just doesn't work. That's why we've developed Trackle. Trackle is a sensor, a battery-free sensor, that uh, measures the body core temperature in a row and transfers it wirelessly to a mobile app where the user can see the cycle status directly and uh, we detect the moment of ovulation with a reliability of 98%. That's how it works. Uh, the uh, sensor is placed within the vagina every evening before going to bed. It measures, it transfers the data, and in the morning it's taken out, cleaned, placed in a storage box. It can be used for about one year and needs to be replaced afterwards. So currently there are three million women only in Germany trying to get pregnant and being not yet diagnosed as infertile. And they are about to invest uh, in infertility treatments. Their one cycle of infertility treatment costs 5,000 euros, by the way. We've got one, around about one million women using alternative contraception already and facing this convenience nightmare I've been talking about every day. And last but not least, uh, 7 million women use the pill and they don't use it because they love hormone treatments but because they are lacking of alternatives. Uh, the infertility group is 18 million in Europe, by the way. The competitors can be divided into two groups. There's on the one hand those who use wireless and convenient transmittance of uh, data, but they do not use body core temperature, which lowers security of results. And on the other hand, those who use body core temperature, but they need additional reading devices, for example, that's not convenient. There's one company doing comparably the same as Trackle does on the US, and they are not on the market yet. The business model is quite simple. We are going to sell the hardware via an online shop and establish a long-term relationship with our users via an ABO model for the sensor that needs to be replaced. Uh, after one year of market activities, we plan to reach out to further European markets, and you can find all the numbers on the handout also, but basically we are going to sell the device for 150 euros and produce it for 90 euros. That's the team. A uh, team of professionals. I'm a unit director of a web agency. Uh, uh, Max is CEO of his own development agency. Stefan is a successful serial entrepreneur and CEO of an IoT company. And we've got great uh, designers on board for the app development. So the sensor prototype is up and running and delivering great data. Uh, the app and back-end development teams are working. We've kicked off the certification process for the CE certification. And uh, since we launched our website last December, we already have 300 interested registered users without basically doing nothing. And we are certified as eligible for investments. Now we are looking for investors and business angels. We need seed capital of around about 700K. That's me. Contact me if you're interested. Thank you. <laughs>